What is going on guys? Today I'm going to be showing you how to change your practice arena player. So if you go into learn to play, you'll be able to find your player right here. So for instance, if we want to just generically do something, so let's go to the pro camera like so, and then we'll resume from here. You can obviously go ahead and just start playing. So if we just keep moving, hopefully we can grab the ball and move it. And as we can see, we can obviously do the scenario so we can go and play with whatever we want here. If we want to change this player, what you have to do is go over to, which is normally better off in co-op so you can see it. So for instance, if we are here and we back out, so as you can see, what we can do is grab our player here. We can move him out. Obviously a little bit quicker would be nice. Drop him here, add this one in, and then we can rotate the player. So once we've done that, obviously we can back out to the normal scenario and we can change our player here. Obviously with this, it will all depend on your favorite team. So for instance, we obviously want to be in, well, we're in Manchester United. If we exit here, all we've got to do then is go all the way up to the top here because we have the settings and accessibility. So if you obviously go into your profile, we can go profile manager. And I don't think there is another way of doing this. Let me know down below if you found a better way. But if we go to our favorite team and say we want to go to Man City, we may want to try with Haaland, or obviously you want to try with somebody else, then you just got to go to your favorite team. Then you go back to learn to play. And as you'll be able to see now, we should have changed to Haaland. So again, that is always going to be a nice shout. Then obviously if we wanted to start the game, we again can do that. We just then press the back button to go back to the scenarios. As we can see, we can move our uh, thing a little bit faster, RT to zoom it up. So if we want to bring him on, we can bring him on like that. If you wanted to just take him off straight away, press B and it will drop him off. Obviously, when you were doing this, we want to bring him on here. Then we can obviously drop Haaland back off to the bench. And then we can continue our scenario and we can change our player. Nice and easy. A little bit complicated to start with, but gets into it. There is a whole load of other options that we'll get into. Make sure you like and subscribe and I'll catch you all for the next one.